All right, so the game should be starting at any second now, hopefully. Protect the bombs. There we go. Uh, let's see here, good guy places. That could be a challenge. I think one of them should absolutely be here. Not sure about this window. I think it's easy for them to simply blast it. Obviously one here. Five seconds left. Oh no, we got we want to remove that. Uh, the reason we want to remove that is because it's too easy to use uh, the other way. Far too easy to against whoever is getting inside. Okay, so a number of shields are up. I'm gonna head in here. Okay, so we... I'm out, got a reload! I didn't uh, actually... Ah, uh, is located a bomb. Careful. Tango down. Second floor. Yeah, they are using. And the wolves. Who the hell uses a suppressed shotgun? -y? That's a nice def defense by Mute there. Chanka, of course, holding down the fort. Uh, if Mute just goes all the way, he should be coming up right behind him. You're heading the right way, Mute. Well done. Oh. Nice! Kill, good kill. Reloading on ammo! Diffuser located. Protect the bombs and disable the diffuser. Friendly, last operator standing. It's gonna be tricky. Especially since diffusing time has increased. Oh, nice try, but that that did not hunt. You have entered an enemy controlled area. Leave now. Nice try. Mission failed. A bomb was defused. Oh well. Not displeased with uh, my performance there, but could have been better. I'm gonna pick a Maru with the shotgun and the SMG. Uh, while I do enjoy the G8, um, let's pick let's pick the breaching shotgun and the G8 just to be fun with it. But the reason anyone would pick the Supernova over the G8 is because when you've breached a window with her gadget, then you want the gun up as soon as possible, and the Supernova shoulders a lot faster than the G8 does. The G8 is notoriously slow at shoulder rate. Uh, the, however, the G8 is still better at uh, just laying down a lot of fire, so it's a trade-off, obviously. But using the shotgun... Uh, oh, they're on ground floor as well, so 
Amaru is not going to be that. Oh, nice. Nice little hidey spot here. I'm gonna just keep my drone here. In a situation like this, where we are on the uh, ground floor and the enemy is on top. Oh, sorry, the enemy is on ground floor. Uh, Amaru is best Five used to uh, basically take to the second floor and clear out any drones. Problem is that we now have the diffuser. As you can see, shouldering the G8 is a very slow process. what I wanted to do, but we repelled it quicker than we... Reinforced here. Hatch open. My screws down. If we can find anyone we want to. Reloading. You must ah, recover fuck the it. Down to one we managed to injure Frost at least. Sadly, we got exposed by Leash. That's gonna hurt. <sighs> Not really going well for us, is it? Still, it's a fun game. I'll give it that, at least. Uh, we can get, grab the shotgun for this one. Have a bit of... Or do we do we keep the... Yeah, I'm gonna keep the shotgun. Basically just to try to get some more games under my belt for, for heading into ranked. Warming up a bit, making sure that um, when I do head back into ranked, I have at least a semblance of my old reflexes still there. Protect the bombs. I'm gonna place... Ah, oh, never mind. Uh, let's Our see here. We have one Never obvious... Activated. One obvious place here. Placing one here might be dangerous to my own team, but... Down to 10 seconds. Camera initiated. Down put one down seconds. here then. Bomb located by Op 4. Done. Need to be very careful here you now. I don't actually think we got anyone on there. We got the reinforcements down just in time, please. 
So if they want to go through the hatch, they're not going to. Absolute silence. Yeah, I know where you are, thank you. You may not call me anymore. One out four remaining. Not bad, not bad. But we are gonna die. Located. Protect the bombs and disable the diffuser. We're so dead. <laughs> I didn't even see the guy. It was a nice placement by the uh, attackers there, taking over the turret there. Not gonna say, uh, not gonna say anything against it. So we placed top with 5 kills, uh, decent enough. Let's just find another match immediately, just keep it, keep it grindy. Ah, I had fun, I don't care that we lost 0-3, that was actually a really fun game. And uh, part of it was that I felt that I actually performed well, but also how I... I'm not gonna say I almost got him in the last round, because that's not true. Uh, or at least it's not... Ah, uh, we got brought in as replacements for an ongoing match. I hate being brought on as a replacement in an ongoing match. I mean, and it's round one, so... God. Well, it's not like we have that much choice about it anyway, so... Looks like to be even, at any rate. I do get why people use the laser sight, but to me, the risk of being detected is uh, sim simply means that uh, I almost never use it. Down to oh, one friendly. that's gonna hurt. Especially since that was a friendly fire accident. Hostile activity. Once the threat is neutralized. Shoot him again! Yeah, Jackal is getting a uh, report griefing. Op 4 eliminated. Friendly mission successful. I mean, I, d I don't have any tolerance for people doing stuff like that. So, the, as you could see, the report functions are now more specified uh, in terms of cheating, griefing, stuff like that. Uh, really, really enjoy that, actually. Uh, I'm gonna pick Goyo and so again, and probably someone is gonna shoot me in the back, because that's what people do when you pick the new operators, right? At least that's the way I hear it. Barricade the room. We need to protect the biohazard container. Right, we'll put one down right there. Op 4 drone located the biohazard container.
Reloading! Ten seconds to insertion. Let's see here. Yep. Five seconds to insertion. Let's just put up some reinforcement here and uh, deal with that as it comes. One interesting thing about Rainbow Six Siege, it's very unusual for me to run out of ammunition. It almost never happens. I don't know why I just thought about that now, but it's true. Uh, almost, almost never have I run out of ammunition. I mean, it happens once, like in a blue moon, like that. And in a way, the way I use Gaia's um, gadget is like a delaying tactic. I make sure that There's a drone somewhere in this room. I think they got him. Op four, last operator standing. Nice Vulcan detonated. Yeah, there's still a drone somewhere around here. Left, 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 left. Uh, nice. We eliminated. Mission successful. Well, at least we lived through it, so. Next round. Let's do this. Main gate, Amaru with the shotgun. Uh, or no. We'll, we'll pick the slower option, but the more fun one. Find the biohazard container location. Let's do this. This is another map where I think Gaio is going to be more effective climbing up hatches more than anything else. There's not really that many windows. Vigil. Um, there, so I think that's what we need to do. We need to find a hatch to basically reach up from. Ten seconds before insertion. Because there is not simply Five not seconds. going to be that many windows for us to breach. Proceed to the biohazard container and secure it. But look, as you as you can see, holstering the HK21 is uh, low as fuck. Cover me. Uh, Ash is trying to uh, break any whatever record there might be for. Getting ahead of Gaio. I 
I know there's... Ah, fuck it. I was gonna say, I know there's someone here. Uh, but Vigil sadly had the beat on me uh, far too quickly. That was a really nice angle hold by uh, Vigil, so nothing to say about it, really. Nice, that C4 is not going to detonate anytime soon. Hostile activity neutralized the threat. We'll have to watch those mirror windows. Stop securing Ow, the that's gonna hurt. Resume securing the container once the threat is neutralized. Bandit has used his C4, so. One threat Oh, that's really hurtful. That was actually a really nice play by Bandit too, just basically just going in there and getting the job done. I mean, that, that was really good. Let's pick a shotgun this time around. A little more accuracy there. Barricade the room. We need to protect the biohazard container. Alright, so uh, go setting up their reinforcement. Op four drone has found the biohazard container. So let's have a look. See, uh, we don't have any one. Perfect position for one of them. Op four has located the biohazard container. Good enough for the second one. Let's close down some side lines as well. Doorway barricaded. They're coming down the stairs on ping. Okay, man. Okay. Impact out. Move. Can't go down, unknown. Oh, there's a few somewhere around here. I didn't see that Maverick had actually dropped down. I was fairly convinced whoever was still there would not be in that corner, and that's a dangerous assumption to do. Very dangerous indeed, uh, and stupid for that matter. Uh, but at least they got Maverick, so... I mean, Maverick hauled ass once everything was said and done, so... Op 4 
eliminated. Mission successful. Ah. Uh, I think it's go uh, gonna do at least one more casual. Then I may need to uh, get get busy with the dealings of the day, but I think we can I think we can squeeze in another casual. Just one kill this time around. We'll just click that find another match immediately. Oh, new canal, nice. This could be fun. And we defend the first round. Those guard meeting room. I'm gonna wait a few seconds, see if anyone else wanna pick. like the people who are playing right now does not have the decent pass. Okay, so at least one here. We'll place down another one here. Put the eight reinforcements on this hatch, so uh, someone is not gonna put go through it and kill it all. Ten seconds. Five seconds. There we go. I mean, having to barricade lower hatches is a very interesting you may, dynamic that uh, Amaru is uh, basically bringing to the table. You don't really have much choice. And down. Nice by Jagger there. Get another, another casualty. Enemy lost one, got one. Ah, fuck it. There were two of them too, so... I got sloppy. Hopefully someone detonates that sh that shield too, because that is going to have to happen at some point. Ah, never mind. Ouch! That was a really nice play there. Sadly, it didn't work out. Interesting to see how much we are actually transitioning in, securing the container. in terms of... I mean, our enemies seem to have a really interesting rotation going on there. 
Nice try. Mission failed. All friendlies were eliminated. So Amaru with the shotgun this time around. And we're going to re No, we're actually not gonna remove the laser sight because I think that in the end Oh, someone else already picked her. Uh, let's see here. Why not Nook? I almost never play Nook, so we might as well do that. I mean, she has shotgun too, right? Not that it's actually one that I would consider using, but hey. But I can see why people are more rel uh, The thing about Amaro versus Gaio is that it's far easier to uh, to look good getting kills with Amaru thanks to her gadget. But uh, the same cannot really be said for the biohazard container has been located. Uh, the same cannot really be said for Gaio. I mean Gaio his gadget can be triggered by anyone, like, it's not really a... the kind of fast-moving... Uh, kill streak kind of operator. Five seconds to go. Ah, uh, they have Gaia as well. Biohazard container located. Location. by Sophia. I don't know if this is gonna work or not, but we'll see. I'm gonna hold here until the gadget is recharged. That didn't work. That did not work at all. However, at least it wasn't the... I was worried I just rushed into a room without checking the room first. And at least I got, didn't get killed that way. So at least uh, my death was due to a very quick snapshot and not anything else. Last operator standing. Not sure about what I think about the gonna get knifed or not four last up oh that's so fucking close Secure the room. Protect the bio oh poor cap can I really pity cap can now oh To be honest, Amaru should have stayed stationary because the submachine gun is always gonna win against a light machine gun in that situation, but... So, we're on defense again. Um, maybe pick something entirely different. I mean, it's not really like we're p picking a theme anyway, so let's let's just go with Kevera. See if we can't uh, do something sneaky. I mean, I really need more practice with the sneaky operators. I s sometimes have too much of a focus of the breachers or the shooters, but yeah, I think I need to play more with the sneaky, sneaky bastards as well.
And Kevera certainly qualifies as well as we well does not come my dad. The interesting thing is that I didn't put a suppressor on Kavara's gun, even though I really ought to. But the extended barrel in most cases is the far better option, so... Okay, so why can't I see the Twitch drone? I saw the... shot from the Twitch drone going out, so why didn't I see the actual drone? Ah, well. They're gonna have a jackal, so I want to be very key about where I am. And that's also why I activated Silent Step, so the jackal can't track it. We'll see if we get any hints of when they engaged. Basically, I'm currently guarding the hatch down. Interrogate next time, please. I mean, that was that was just annoying because I wanted to get the interrogation done, and I could have. At least Pulse got shot for his misery. I know where he is. Thanks to Sound Step, at least Jackal couldn't track me, but uh, I didn't really take that engagement as well as I should have. One out four remaining. Either way, as far as I'm concerned, Pulse basically stole my interrogation kill there. And I'm not really happy about it, because that interrogation would have been very useful. But if you're hunting kills, you're hunting kills, and then you have nothing to do in this game. I'm gonna grab a Mara for this one. Uh, yeah, you look to be good. Find the biohazard container location. Nicely done. The biohazard container has been located. Ten seconds 
to insertion. All right, so they are in a very um, very Amuru friendly spot. I'm gonna do this because I have to. Uh, we got the raw end of the spawn, but I can live with that. But I need to do Amaru things now. Yeah, you are right now is getting a reward abusive chat. Secure the biohazard container. Stop securing the container. Ready to torch. Securing the container once the threat is neutralized. Op four eliminated. That was actually a really nice Maverick shot right there. Oh well. Ah oh, crap, we're not done yet. We have another round at least. Start by the sailboats. I'm not gonna pick a Maru this time unless someone else does. I'm gonna wait for the entire rest of the team to pick before I pick. Four enemies. There's three of them left and locate the biohazard container. Let's roll. Well done. Biohazard container located. Looks like we are not getting up there. At least we know where the objective is. We don't have eyes on it. Well, that's just tricky. Okay, so let's run it. I really like the artwork on this shotgun. I mean, it's just splendid in every single way. Let's move up and make sure we have decent cover for any peeking that might be going on. I am fucking blind because I did not see Valkyrie. However, Valkyrie did see me. But yeah, I am I was just blind there. I was just too intent on rushing in and being careless and stuff like that. That was entirely my own fault. Ouch, that's gonna hurt. Interesting bit of distraction going on there. We'll see if that works or not. I would say it has every chance of actually working. Just don't shoot that thing. 
Don't want to give the gamer away. Careful, Sophia, careful. Oh! Yeah, once the threat is neutralized. Op 4 eliminated all friendlies. Well, that'll have to be it for now. Can I report him, like, again? No, I can't. I wish I could. I mean, he kind of does earn it. Yeah, and that'll have to be it for this morning. But it, it was a nice, nice, uh, relaxing way to just get some siege done. It was far too... Oh, we even got an alpha pack. So let's switch back to the stream and open it up and see yeah, it's... No, I will literally never use that. I will literally never ever use that. Alright, so that'll have to be it for now. Take care and I'll see you guys next time.